beautiful and amazing brand ambassador to have thank you yeah. thank you so much i'm very very excited to be here today thank you Sharad. thank you steve thank you lee for having me here thank you Parab. oh my god of course <laughs> pick me pick me <laughs> that goes without saying of course thank you yeah but, but we, uh, heard, we heard Sharad say about uh, this whole search for the brand ambassador and the catalyst as he called it to to launch this body optics in india yeah. Uh, but tell us about your connect with the brand and the fabulous jeans that you are wearing today. Well, I mean, for me, it's, um, you know, first of all, Lee is a brand that I've grown up with. And, um, you know, I think growing up as well, we all love our denims. Denims is something that's synonymous with our childhood. And um, Lee is just, it's definitely, it's an iconic brand. It's something I've grown up with. And it's, it's been very inspirational, aspirational for me. Um, and when it came, you know, when, when Lee had um, uh, decided on this uh, union, I was so excited because I'm very picky when it comes to my brands. Um, for me, it's, it's about being authentic. It's about believing 100% in the brand that you're endorsing and uh, so that you can give 100%. So, um, yeah, and when they came, I just felt it was the perfect fit, you know. Uh, Lee is all about adventure and, and staying curious and, and comfort. And uh, that's, I think, what I'm all about as well. So, yeah. I mean, uh, this is a question, I mean, I'm posing to you, Jacqueline, but of course, uh, Sharad, feel free to, to jump in. Yeah. Uh, I mean, for me, and I think for lots of people here also, uh, Lee predominantly is a man's brand. You know, you think of a cowboy rodeo sort of fellow uh, in, <laughs> in the poster. and. And here you have Jacqueline, you know, launching a very important product of yours. So, I'll leave it to her first. What do you <laughs> feel about that? What was that? I'll leave it to you first. Oh, well, um, well, I guess, I, I think that that just goes to show how cool Lee yeah. as a brand is. Um, the fact that, you know, we're, we're living, uh, it's, it's 2017. Uh, we're modern, we're forward. Um, it's not about gender anymore. I, don't, I think like if you discriminate against gender right now, it's like it's the most backward thing you could do. Uh, so it's not even a topic that's up for discussion. Um, so, you know, it's, it's, I just think it's amazing that yeah. this became more about the personality um, uh, that they wanted to, you know, connect with than it being based on gender. Because at the end of the day, that is the world that we're living in right now. And that's what we're trying, I think, that's the message that we're trying to send out. So. Uh, to yeah, that? sure. So, uh, exactly what she said. So, so we are. So exactly what sorry, she. Sorry. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'm not used to this, so that's why. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get you there. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, when we went looking, uh, you know, when the idea of a brand ambassador came to us, so we were absolutely gender agnostic when it comes to us. So I'll give you one commercial reason. Of course, we have a significant. Uh, share of our business that comes from women's wear. It's a growing category. But more importantly, we wanted somebody to connect with the brand ethos. So, so we believe, you know, she has the right activity. She has the right interest. She, so we look for an urban explorer. So I think her, her activities embody what an urban explorer should be like. So gender was really not even into consideration. And I'll tell you what, Jackie knows way more than some of my team members about our collections. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She knows about <laughs> urban. Actu right? I've actually become a scientist. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Learning. Rapid fire round on that. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, can, I, can, brush up. I can bet you she, she knows. Do you know about urban riders? Do you know about Jade Fusion? These are all. Of course. Yeah, these are all menswear products. So, yes. I mean, she's, she's kind of. So she'll be our 
talking point when it comes to menswear as well. And I know that she'll do it very well. I think she has a, she has a, uh, like a sheet with, a, with like ticking off all the brands that are pro predominantly male brands. I'm going to take over. I'm going to take over. I'm going to take over. I'm yeah, take yeah, over. Exactly. yeah, yeah. That was <laughs> there. <No>. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was there. I'm not going to talk about other brands now. <laughs> Watch out. Yeah. I'm coming. See, but you want to add anything to that? Yeah, I would add that uh, when Sherrard and the team um, told us about Jacqueline, uh, they submitted no other names to the global team. We took one look at her beauty and style and her wonderful story coming to this country and really reinventing herself and we loved it and there was, it was obvious and so we are really honored thank you, that Steve. you are here thank with you. us and, oh. and working with us at Lee. Thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> so now you have, you have media launch, you have a brand ambassador, you have the big boys of the brand here with us. I'm presuming you have a commercial also. A sort of campaign that oh, you guys yeah. are, are, have shot and, and have it. Goes without saying. Goes without saying. So, <laughs> uh, do you guys think you could unveil that for us today? Let's do uh, it. Sometime, what do you think? Sometime, sometime. But for now, I think we could be content with the making, right? The making, yeah. yeah, sure, yeah that's yeah, fine. Yeah, that, that should be Candidly cool. talking oh, about yeah, 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 what yeah, to yeah. expect <laughs> from, the, from, from the advert. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys, so can All we right. have that, uh, Jackie? Sure. All right. I don't know what that last posture I was, uh, I don't know what I was doing over there. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, that's the first question of the next section. Gymnastic stuff. Yeah, that's why I didn't send you for edit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like, hey, I'm not approving that shot. But uh, Sharad and Steve, can we ask you to uh, step down just yeah, for sure. a moment? Don't oh, go to the no. bar yet. That's so mean. <laughs> no, 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 don't go to the bar yet because we're going to call you guys back on. Wait, is this for the rapid fire? Yeah. No, sure. Rapid fire is later. Sure, I don't think you should leave. <laughs> stay where I stay, stay somewhere. No, they're not far. You. They're right there. So in case okay, you, uh, 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 you don't I need have some an tips. answer, yeah, you need exactly. to look straight there. <laughs> okay. All right. So uh, Jacqueline, do you have a seat? Okay. We're going to have a little chat with her about the campaign, being a part of this campaign. Okay. Starting off with that pose that we saw. Uh, yes, um, I'm very confused. Right now. Of, the, of the denim. <laughs> but actually, that 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 is actually it. Like the, the Lee jeans are so flexible. When it comes to denims as well, I think like you just want to be very comfortable. It needs to feel like second skin. Um, style, quality, all of that is important as well. But um, yeah, I mean, for me, being a jeans person is because I like comfort in my life. So, um, and you know me, I'm running around everywhere. I'm dancing. I'm like doing some kind of gymnastics thing. I'm, I'm always moving. So I think that last shot was, you know, yeah, actually, it was... Yeah, it just, it just seemed like you can do... Anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Denims. Absolutely, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me about, I mean, you started off by saying reshaping your world. Yeah. Tell me something about that, these, these denims reshaping your world or the brand reshaping your world. Um, you know, uh, that was something that was very important. Uh, that tagline for me was very important because, uh, uh, you know, I am someone, like Steve actually mentioned, and it's so nice for you to, to know this, but uh, I am someone who, you know, came from a different country. Uh, I came here. Uh, it was difficult in the beginning, um, and you realize along this journey that uh, you're the only one out there who can help yourself. Nobody else is going to do it for you. So if you want to achieve something, if you want a goal, if you have a dream, um, you have to go out there and you have to just fight for it. So, um, and, and that's what I did. I kind of, um, I, I reshaped my world in a way um, for what it could have been to what it is now. And, um, and along the way, it was just, it's, it's been an amazing magical experience but it's taught me so much so you know when when Lee um, had mentioned you know this tagline to me I was like oh my god like that's something I can so relate to because um, that that actually has been my journey so yeah, yeah big reshaping from Sri Lanka that's where that's yes, where you were yeah exactly before. yeah we um, love Sri Lanka I love Sri Lanka <laughs> We all, yeah, we all love Sri Lanka. We all love Sri Lanka. Yeah, yeah you, you've been spending a uh, good time here in Mumbai, I would say. Yes. You had a fabulous 2016. Lots yes. of hard work. and S lots of Super busy. And paid off hard work. Because it, I mean, good stuff we saw from you in 2016. I'm thinking 2017 also is, is quite an exciting Well, year. hello. We've started the year right now. It's the, it's the beginning of the year, and we've got this amazing announcement. So for me, it's been a fantastic start. Uh, my association with Lee, you know, and... Um, I couldn't have asked for more. So stepping a little away from Lee now, tell us a, tell us, <laughs> that's the only answer she's the <laughs> Sorry. 